638 now this morning, a four year old boy is home safe today after a frightening encounter with a gorilla at the Cincinnati Zoo. The endangered gorilla is now dead and the entire ordeal was caught on camera. Brian Webb has the story. The little boy is barely visible under Harambe the gorilla 15 feet below his mother. For a moment, it seems like Harambe is protecting him until... Kim O'Connor shot the video and was near the boy and his mother before hearing a splash in the moat. The little boy, I'm going to go in. No, you're not. I'm going to go in. No, you're not. The mother turns around to her other children. The four-year-old boy climbed through a barrier and dropped into the exhibit. Two female gorillas responded to a command by zoo trainers to leave, but the 400-pound Harambe did not. O'Connor says he ran out of his cave toward the boy, dragged him through the moat twice, and then up a concrete section of the exhibit. When he scaled him up, his head's banging against the wall as he's climbing up. And so that's the part that people didn't see. After 10 minutes, zoo employees shot and killed the 17-year-old endangered gorilla, fearing a tranquilizer might further agitate the ape. It seemed very much by our professional team, our dangerous animal response team, to be a life-threatening situation. And so the choice was made uh, to put down or shoot Harambe. In a statement, the family said, we extend our heartfelt thanks for the quick action by the Cincinnati Zoo staff. We know that this was a very difficult decision for them and that they are grieving the loss of their gorilla. Doctors at a Cincinnati hospital treated and released the boy just hours after the incident. Brian Webb for CBS News, New York.